As we all know, our moon has two phases, waxing and waning. Waxing starts from new moon and ends at full moon. Waning phase starts from full moon and ends at new moon. This is a model of the phases of moon made by one of my students, uh, Deepak. Uh, thank you, Deepak. So here uh, it starts from waxing phase and as we know waxing phase starts from new moon. So this is a symbolic representation of, uh, of new moon and uh, next is the waxing crescent. Uh, only this much part of the moon will be seen and this much will be uh, covered. Then the next is the first quarter in which one quarter of the moon we can see in the sky. Then it is waxing gibbous. Uh, like, uh, uh, more than half will be seen and the uh, uh, least part will be covered and this phase will be uh, ending at uh, full moon that is uh, last part of the waxing phase after waxing the next phase will start that is vanning phase and the first part in vanning is vanning gibbous second phase of the moon is last quarter in which again only the one fourth of the part will be seen and the rest will be covered after that it is a uh, vanning crescent after vanning crescent the vanning phase will be end that is on new moon so in this way the moon completes its uh, whole cycle we see phases of moon because of two reasons one the moon's angle with respect to sun two the reflection of sunlight since moon is a non luminous object the part on which sunlight falls will be lit and the other will be dark. I hope you have understood about the phases of moon. Thank you.